How often have you made a purchase purely because you saw it in a window, or more likely on a website homepage, and then decided there and then that it was screaming your name and bought it? If your self-control is anything like mine, that's actually how you do most of your shopping. The impulse buy, while mostly fun and sometimes a huge mistake, is on the wane as marketing learns how to talk to consumers long before they reach the shop front. So let's find out how. Hey guys, it's Trav here from Neighborhood where we help brands find, sell, and keep their people. Typically, before truly becoming a customer, an individual goes through what we like to call a marketing funnel. It compromises of a variety of stages from the buyer becoming aware of your product or service to them doing their research, reaching out to the business before finally committing to buying it. In the modern age, it's easiest to visualize it as all of the stuff a person does on their phone prior to actually buying something. Researching a company, checking with friends that also own the product, messaging the company to learn more, etc. It's a concept that many marketers and salespeople use to define the journey that a potential customer takes before pulling the trigger. The stages themselves can change depending on what model you choose to use. But with each stage, the amount of potential customers within the funnel lessens, hence the whole funnel shape. The goal of the marketer is to move their prospects through the funnel, turning those people with what are passing interest in your brand into valued customers. Let's take a look at the three stages of a funnel that will help you sell your product like a pro. Number one, the understanding stage, or what we like to call it, top of the funnel or tofu. At this stage, the prospects are discovering your services and products. For this, they will research channels like your social media pages and informative content like blog posts. You want your SEO to be on point here so that you can show up when they inevitably turn to Google for the search. To get on the radar at this point, you want to create awareness about who you are and what you do. Creating content themed around sorts of issues that your customers may be facing and that your product and service could help alleviate. Almost everyone goes online to check out their options before making a major purchase these days. We're glued to our phones, and why wouldn't we? Therefore, there is a great chance that your customers fall within this category. One of the most powerful ways to grab their attention is using high quality content like blogs or white papers. Use social media channels to promote your stuff and get that SEO on the up and on your way up to the top of the funnel success. Number two, the education stage or middle of the funnel or MOFU. Time for your prospects to learn a thing or two, helping them move them from the top to the middle of the funnel. Now is the right time to start talking about solutions, ways to fix the issues or problems that you've outlined in the top of the funnel content. You're teaching people and educating them on how to help themselves and preparing them to show them how to specifically help them in stage three or bottom of the funnel. Blogs are a nice way to grab the attention of your customers and use of case studies and eBooks with educational slant. You really want to engage with your customers at this point as they're going to cut loose any solutions that are not a good fit for their problem. If you enjoy this video, make sure you subscribe and leave a like. And if you're on YouTube, make sure you hit that bell so that you can stay up to date on all of our latest videos delivered every single week to your inbox. And number three, the verdict stage, or bottom of the funnel, or BOFU. Your big finish is the content that specifically talks about your own products and services. By now, your prospects should have a good understanding of their problem, have some sort of ideas for the solution, and be on the search for a specific product or service to help them fix that problem. We strongly recommend ensuring that your product or service they're looking for is yours. We've waited till now to talk about ourselves because these people have shown that they're invested. Some of the most effective types of content that works at this point are trial offers, demos, product literature, and case studies. Talk about yourself, you've earned it. So this is how you become a content marketing pro. It's not all you need, of course. The funnel is just one of those things that you should look into as a part of a serious, Reasons Digital Marketing Strategy. Take your time, understand your consumer or customer, and then build a content marketing strategy that'll help accelerate the number of prospects you have by your side right now. So if you found this video helpful, then feel free to share it with someone that you know that needs a hand with their content marketing. You can also subscribe to our blog where you'll find a bunch more tools, tips, and templates to help you find, sell, and keep your people, just like Neighborhood does. And that's it from us, happy selling.